Disney was in the news on Friday as the House of Mouse is set to announce a slew of cost-cutting measures, including layoffs, hiring freezes in multiple non-essential departments. Investors were happy with the news as the stock went up around 5% on Friday. Mark, with so many of these companies announcing massive layoffs in weeks, that is the trend here. When might we see the impact in official job market numbers? Well, you know, it's a little more complicated than that because a lot of um, a lot of these jobs are needed to go anyway. Some of them are unfilled. Um, and the other thing is that these megacorps don't really represent where all the hiring is. You know, the U.S. economy ha has had a, a issue where we had too many people working in these tech jobs and we don't we still do not have enough people working in the trades, people working in service, uh, people working um, retail, all, you know, there is still a, a huge amount of middle class and and um, lower income jobs that are wide open. Where where we're going to get hit uh, in is in places like California and and um, on the East Coast in some of these tech names and in a little bit. I feel like the banking sector is going to take some some losses in the deal flow space. Um, I don't think you're going to be seeing any layoffs on bond desks anytime soon, folks, or in trading departments. Um, but there, the, this layoff segment is going to be, UPS is not going to be firing a bunch of people. Um, I don't think FedEx is. I don't think you're going to see factory jobs because they're all still desperate for people to work. It's mm -hmm. all upper middle management and middle management in Facebook and Meta where they were just completely over hired in jobs that did not do very much. Disney, kind of the same problem. You're not, you're not gonna see Disney firing a bunch of people that work at the parks. Uh, you're gonna see them laying off, uh, you know, how many new Disney Plus shows mm -hmm. did they need? How many, you know, how many people do they need in, across, in their corporate department? So this, this firing cycle is gonna be very different than uh, past firing cycles and that there's going to be very, very little, if any blue collar firing, heck, we might see a net positive in, on the blue collar side and it could be a white collar, it could be a white collar uh, bloodbath, at least for corporate mm -hmm. America, because that's where they're way too heavy. So Mark, like you said, not, not those who are working in the parks, but those who are designing the parks is what we might yeah, see. Those who are telling the workers in the parks where to go and what they should be doing and how and all the rules and regulations they're going to get fired but winnie the pooh still going to be there okay <laughs>